So in terms of lane, I can get why you would pick Yasuo here. It seems like a safer choice. But late game, it will be very difficult to kill. Jin Air, Corky Yasuo, Rumble, aiming for a big, big power surge in, in the mid game. Yeah, we'll see if it works. Jin Air trying to tie it up. Let's get in the game and see if they can pull it off. Yeah. Not, a, not a big problem for GBM. Still has not taken a lot of damage in this lane. Uh -oh. Chaser trying to get in there for the knockup. There's the last breath onto Someday, but Someday's pretty tanky. Does he have enough? Can he get out? No flash. GBM cutting him down. Chaser very low. First blood taken by Someday in the 1v2. GBM looking for some revenge. He gets it. Trace able to pick that kill up, and now the escape attempt from Jin Air, but Trace in a lot of trouble. Nagne coming up with those twin fangs. Oh, man. Score takes the kill, but Jin Air. Yeah, so his base damage is pretty incredible. Yeah, even with that tier, things are not bad. Trying to go nope. after him again. Ult is are. up now. Yeah, there's the Equalizer down on the Sunday. I think he's going to have a harder time making it out of this one. Yep, the ult getting burned through pretty quickly. Sunday lives for a while. But oh, Chaser actually took that kill. kill, too. That wasn't good. We've had junglers taking kills. They have a Corky, so... They do. But the Braum is going to be there in the choke. And here comes the Rek'Sai, all healed up right now. Equalizer, very dangerous. Knock up on the Nogne. G uh, GBM wasn't there to, pull, to uh, capitalize on that. Someday coming in, there's Equalizer going down. A lot of AOE damage onto KT right now. Sweet looking for another knock up opportunity. There goes Someday. GBM picks up that kill. Dragon still GBM alive right still now. GBM still has his ult. That's right, waiting for things. Steel Tempest over the wall, not catching anyone with that. Trace doing a lot of damage to Nogne, just turning and roasting Fixer instead. And wow, Jin Air able to take the Dragon and the fight with a couple kills there. No problem. And KT now has to walk through a choke against this Corky and this Equalizer. Good luck. In order to get some sort of position. They're split up a little bit right now. Trace is waiting there to use his Flame Spitter. Someday finds an angle, but he's getting ticked by the Leandris. Oh boy. Oh, there's a knockup. There's the Equalizer coming down. The Brahm ult, though, prevents Jin Air from coming in too quickly. Arrow and Score doing a little bit of damage from the outside. Someday coming in as well. Dragon taken by Jin Air, but the first kill comes in for Nogne. Jin Air in a little bit of trouble. GBM at about half health right now. Chaser turning around trying to zone. Smite goes down into Someday. Pilot though, Valkyrie away after Someday chases him in. Chaser getting back. There's the last breath though. GBM doing some damage, getting taken down though by Arrow. There's a double kill now. That re-engage may come back to haunt Jin Air. It looks like it's not working out. Fight where GBM is not exhausted. Yeah. There, that is just not going to happen. KT is not going to give Janair the go. opportunity for picks either. Sweet goes deep. Janair wants to engage. There's a knock up. No last breath, though. KT just turning immediately onto this Alistar. Nogne doing a lot of damage from the outside as well as Arrow. Oh, boy. Janair, this is not the greatest idea. GBM in a lot of trouble already. Someday knocked up. Looks like they might be able to get a kill. No. Two kills for Nogne. Now, Someday still alive. Another one for Arrow. GBM long dead. A triple kill for Nogne now. And Trace goes down. That is an ace. Jin Air started that fight. They wanted to try something there, and well, I think they, yeah, that's oh, interesting. I mean, obviously they they found something that they thought worked, um, and it can work. We've seen it work, but against a team like KT, against some of the better teams in the league, and here we go. They're going to try again. There's a nice last breath onto Nogne, but look at that, still okay. All the focus of Nogne just turns and ults after all the CC ends, and that means KT is going to be able to turn this one right around. Yep, taking out. The top laner first, and KT just rolling over Jin Air. Pilot the last man standing. Long distance twisted advance and score coming in. Oops, dies to the turret there. <laughs> Pilot gets a kill, but it's still going to be an ace in the end as well. Combo unless somebody else starts it for you, and you have, like, less damage. Here we go. Uh, well, they caught someday, but here comes Nogne and the rest of KT. Another ult comes down. So they do get the kill onto Maokai, but Score just throwing out those hate spikes. And here we go. Arrow pops his ultimate. Nagne coming in for more, some more kills. A kill for Arrow. Score chasing everybody down at this point. He's got such speed. He does. So does Nagne, too. Yep. Nagne dodging that. The great chase. Another kill for Nagne coming in. They've got that turret there, but I don't think Nagne is really going to be deterred by this. GBM hiding behind his wind wall for the moment, anyway. That is going to be about it. Well, final turret going down, and so now the inhibitor wide open. KT rushing into the base. Nice ult. Wow, GBM already nearly blown up. Equalizer comes down. They get on the Nogne. Nogne just cleansing out of everything. Easy peasy, and 
KT, understandably, with another easy win here. In this fight, exhaust onto Trace. He's gonna style Zonius before going down. Another double kill for Nogne. Pilot watches with sadness from the fountain. GG and KT takes the 2-0. So, yeah, like you said, a quicker affair than we expected, but KT really showing their dominance in uh, picks and bans here tonight, playing things out well, and Jenner making it hard for themselves uh, in different ways in both games. <laughs> They're very good at using varied methods to make the League of Legends matches hard for them to win. Jenner Jenner continues to confuse in picks and bans, I feel. They're really and their own worst enemy, aren't they? I mean, they kind of are. But that was a great win by KT again, like you said, showing some really good adaptations in that pick ban phase and uh, having pretty big edges going into the games before they even started. And then the team just playing it out beautifully. Yep. They they played around the Yasuo and the Varus extremely well. They knew how to take down those compositions and they did it in a very clean fashion. So unfortunately, Jenner Green Wings will fall. KT on the rise. And now Jenner and KT will actually be tied in the standings. Yep, that's right. A win for KT Rolster. Man, they're looking good right now.